again, I know it's been a while since I've done a video. Um, lots has been going on. Lots has been go a lot of things have been going on. And just, you know, I told you guys in my last video, I wasn't really super in to just buying purses and clothes and shoes, you know, because I moved and I've really been kind of wanting to do more DIY things. I've been making more uh, home decor and stuff. I actually have some paintings down here that I did that I just need to find a place to put them up at or decide where I'm going to put them up. I don't know. But I've been doing a lot more crafty things and I want to start building stuff. I'm going to, I have a couple projects in mind and I really want to start using like power tools and stuff. And so I'm, I'm going to post stuff like that as well onto this channel because it's just really just a reflection of me and the things I'm really into and the things I enjoy doing and stuff. And it's, you know, I'm, I'm more than just handbags and shoes. Uh, that being said, I have obtained a couple of new things to add to my collection. Um, I got a new handbag, a new SLG, and a new pair of shoes. Uh, <laughs> I know, despite what I just said, I have been buying new stuff, and I wanted to share that stuff with you guys and, and kind of give you my review, my thoughts on these products, because um, I've had them for a little bit, and I've used them, and I just want to let you guys know what I think, I guess. Um, just in case you're considering these same items. So the first thing I want to share with you is my new handbag. And I'm so excited because it's the very first I've had from this designer and or brand brand. So I got the Cassie bag from Coach. I got it in this um, cream pebbled leather. And it's got kind of like, it's got the coppery, bronzy, I don't know, it's not really gold. Maybe it's gold. I don't know. It's kind of like a duller. It's not super bright and shiny gold. It's more like a, a subtle gold uh, hardware on it. And I got it in the large. They do have another option that's more square and stuff. Um, I didn't realize how big this was going to be when I ordered it. But I'm super glad I got it. I had it, I've had it for about a month. And it is amazing. It's my favorite bag. I know I said that that Kate Spade bag that I showed you guys is going to be like my summer fave. Or possibly my summer favorite. It's like, it's this. This is my favorite bag. I absolutely love it. It's got quite a few pockets. It's got an external pocket here. Which I never use. Ever. And this is the bag I'm currently rocking. I've been using it since I got it, so I'm super stoked about that. So here's the inside. It's got a back pocket, a middle, and then a small front one. The pocket on the front. Uh, that one right there. That's where I put my phone. That's where I keep my cell phone. It's pretty tight and compact and stuff, so the wallet I was using wasn't going to fit in it because it was super bulky. So I bought a color block, I think is what it's called. This is just technically considered a card holder, but I love it because it's so thin. Um, it fits perfectly inside the bag. It holds all of my cards. Some of my cards are in the little pocket where the money goes or where your cash would go, but it's not that big of a deal. I don't, I honestly don't care. I love it. I have uh, inside the big pouch in the center, there's a zippy pocket on the back, and then there's a front pouch and stuff. Obviously, you know, us girls, we gotta keep our equipment on us at all times because you never know when you're gonna need it or when you're gonna need to help a fellow lady in, uh, in distress. So I keep those in my zippy pocket. Um, absolutely loving it. It is amazing. I find the coach bag, so I'm super excited about it. Look at it. It's so cute. It's so cute. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. I love it so much. So that was the first two things I wanted to share with you guys. The last thing is a pair of shoes, and uh, yeah, 
these shoes have a story. So I got these, they're Michael Kors, um, platform like kind of walking shoes and I think they're so cute. I absolutely, honestly, they are so cute. They hug your foot, they are comfortable and I got them because to wear on my walks. I go on walks around my neighborhood every night and stuff. I mean, I don't really get out all that often and um, I work out in my garage so um, I go on walks every afternoon and stuff so I wanted something other than my like skater shoes to wear on my walks. So I've been looking at these for like a month. I really love them. I wanted them in the all white. The all white sold out. They offer it in a bunch of different colors. They have like a light pink one. Most of them are actually like multiple colored and kind of look a little weird and like, mm, really? But these ones I thought were really cute because I mean, they, they don't have a lot of different colors. They're um, mostly gray and stuff. I figured they would be kind of a little bit different. I don't have anything in my collection that looks like these shoes and stuff and I had been wearing them for a week. I wore them every day and went walking around my neighborhood um, every every day and stuff. Walked about I mean like an hour. I don't I don't know maybe like a mile and a half or so or like to the back of the neighborhood and back around again and uh, yeah it, everything was working great until Friday. <laughs> Oh my goodness, Friday was the last day I could walk. So yeah, these shoes jacked up my foot so bad. I haven't been able, this is day three now. Day three and I can't walk. Like plantar fasciitis or something like that. The ligament between the heel of my foot that connects like my heel to my toes is inflamed and sore um, from these shoes. Which is crazy, because you would have thought that if any shoes were going to do this to me, it would have been all the heels that I wear. No, it was the tennis shoes. Freaking tennis shoes. So, I'm on ice right now. I have to crawl or hop on one leg to get around my house, and it is insane and uncomfortable. And this pain, so bad. So bad, you guys. Unreal. Un real. I can't put any weight on my foot. I have to keep it on ice, keep it elevated. Like, it's, it's annoying and it's uncomfortable and it just sucks. And apparently, haha, -ha, icing on the cake is that this is like one of the earliest signs of a aging. Yay! So, I think last year, right around this time last year, I like pinched a nerve in my back, like my sciatica or whatever, my sciatic nerve, and I had sciatica for like two weeks. It was horrible. It was so uncomfortable. I just like, I couldn't, I, I felt old. I couldn't really like bend over. I couldn't lift anything. It just like sent fire down my legs and it was uncomfortable and it sucked. And now this year, <laughs> right before my birthday again, I can't walk because the ligament in my foot is swollen or whatever. So apparently this is like how my body is going to be like, hey, happy birthday to you. Another part of us is broken. This is great. I'm looking forward to it. 30s are awesome. <laughs> so anyway, um, those shoes suck. If you want to get those, um, wear them at your own risk. I'm returning them because they jacked up my foot and I can't walk now. And apparently, you don't know when the, your, your foot's going to get better. Like, it could be a week. It could be six weeks. It could be a few months. I don't know how long it's going to take, but I can't walk. And it's ridiculous. I'm home alone with my kids and I can't walk. Like, I have to take care of two little kids and work and I can't walk. So, it's messed up.
That's all I gotta say about it. It's messed up. These shoes suck. I'm sending them back. I don't care how cute they are. I'm usually willing a person that's willing to suffer for fashion. I will be cold because I don't have a jacket that matches my outfit. I will be uncomfortable wearing shoes that shouldn't probably be worn all day or worn to like walk long distances, but they match my outfit and they look cute. So I'll wear that and I will suffer like that. But this, this kind of suffering, no, mm -mm. no, I refuse. So, I think about getting those kind of shoes. They look like this. I don't really remember what they're called, but they are cute. Oh, well, it's already like kind of scuffed a little bit. That's, let's not look at that part of the shoe. They're cute. They're comfy. They'll jack your foot up. That's all I gotta say about that. Anyway, I hope you guys are doing wonderful. I hope you guys are staying safe and healthy and trying to find things to occupy your time. I hope you're enjoying this brand new, this, this brand new summer. This summer, I hope you guys are gonna have fun this summer and try to get outside, get to the beach, go hiking, camping, you know, back to our, back to our roots, you know? So um, anyway, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.